We've all seen the signs, we know the laws, we all know the catchphrases like click it or ticket. We know that seatbelts are there to keep us safe, but do we, as teen drivers, really follow these laws? And are we aware of what could happen if we don't? Here we see a typical teenage driver's car, chock full of passengers, none of them wearing their seatbelts. With the deadly combination of too many passengers, loud music, cell phones, and an inexperienced driver, so many things could go wrong. Here we see a scenario which happens all too often. After driving recklessly and distracted, the driver of the car could get into an accident. And, if none of the passengers are wearing their seatbelts, the chance for injury or death would be much higher, and the fatalities could be hard to bear. In fact, according to a study done by Safe Kids Worldwide, only 54% of high school students reported always wearing a seatbelt when riding with someone else. Wearing a seatbelt really can make the difference between life and death. So remember, always wear your seatbelt, whether you're driving or a passenger in a car. A safe driving scenario would look a little something like this. Notice that while the car still holds many passengers, everyone is wearing their seatbelts, are staying seated, and keeping the music at a level as to not distract the driver. A scenario like this shows that it's possible to stay safe while still having a good time. Good driving habits such as these will result in the safe transport and arrival of the driver and all the passengers in the vehicle. Oh, I had such a fun time in that car ride, I was being safe. Here's a little demonstration of how you should be putting on your seatbelt in the car. First, take the seatbelt. It should come smoothly out of this little little uh, contraption here. You just want to pull it across your lap and make sure it's securely fastened. You should hear a little click, just like that. Make sure that your seatbelt is nice and tight on your lap, across your lap. You don't want to have too much slack. This is definitely a no because you will be pulled forward during a crash and probably get injured or possibly die. You want to make, you want to make sure that um, this is, is across your front. You don't want this <laughs> behind your arm or behind your, uh, your back because obviously there's no restraint None of that. if um, there were to be any sort of an accident. So, if you keep your seatbelt nice and tight like this, <coughs> both hands on the wheel, Ten and, two. And, uh, and make sure that your music is at a, a good level to where you know it's not distracting. And everyone in your car, make sure they have their seatbelts on as well. And that will uh, make for many safe rides in the future. Woo, seatbelts! We are buckling up because that is I should be illegally driving more than one person in the car. Shut up! <laughs> Stop laughing, you're dead. So Sydney said, put your seatbelts on, girls. And that's what we did. Stop talking. This is very nice. Car, make sure they have their seatbelts on as well. See, I got my seatbelt on right here. She doesn't. You don't need to be yeah. obnoxious. Sorry. All right. <laughs>